Good morning, everybody. This is Matt Cadman with Shady Grove Ranch in Jefferson, Texas. I took a little picture of uh, getting set up to load baby chicks this morning out of the brooder house. A nice, warm, protected environment bedded with peat moss to deploy them to pasture. And so we've got right here a little over 1,200 baby chicks. Uh, I ordered 1,200 to give you 4% extra. And Lord willing, you process right about 1,200 at the end of it. So, uh, unfortunately, both of my farm hands are not here today, so I'm uh, completely disgusting all by myself. But uh, anyway, we're deploying these guys. They're going to have a fabulous pasture, pasture life. We've got some uh, really deep coastal and bahia grass right here. Almost too deep, but they will be okay with that. And we're going to move them every day. So uh, we're starting a new process here this week. What we're going to do is we're going to, you know, they're, they're, they're a little bitty. They're barely eating any feed right now. So they're not putting that much out the back end either. So what we're going to do is we're going to deploy all of these in one single range coop. And in about a week and a half, we're going to split the group in half. And then a couple weeks after that, we're going to try to split them uh, into one more. So I guess it'd be each coop, a third will be leaving there. So anyway, just one more, uh, one more step to efficientize this pasture poultry model here at Shady Grove Ranch. And I'm about to go eat some lunch after this. I'm extremely tired. Not tired. Uh, sweaty, disgusting, hungry. I feel like, uh, I imagine this is somewhat like the mental and physical training that they would employ at someone like, uh, uh, like the Marines perhaps. So if any, if any uh, you know, anybody in the upper ranks of the Marines want to, you know, condition their guys before basic training, go ahead and send them on out. I'll take care of it. All right, talk to you all later. Thanks for watching.